Bacon neck? <laughs> What's up, Pete? I don't know. JT Dunn called him a, uh, called Tripolicious a basic. And now bacon neck? That, oh, I'll tell you what. Calling Tripolicious a basic is like, that's like fight words for him, okay? Tripolicious does not see eye to eye with what he considers basic. <laughs> and that's pretty much what he calls everybody else except for himself. And top talent Christian over Christian Casanova, who is not in attendance. Uh oh, oh boy, oh boy, oh no! Good drop kick though. Yeah, Good nice follow up. Nice recovery by Brandon Watts. I think uh, he saw Tripolicious trying to get out of the way, he tried to stop himself as he hit the ropes, but still connected one way or another. And the Shred God and Tripolicious now doing battle at ringside. And Brandon Watts. Now, oh, right oh, like a Christmas tree. They are doing battle at ringside. Outside the ring, referee Rich Bass trying to get both men back into the ring as they continue to battle right into the ring post. Oh, jeez. They take this fight back into the ring. That's legal. Oh. What? Oh, wow. Right into a security guard and the guardrail. Yeah, that's a double shot right there. Down goes the security guard, and down goes Brandon Watts. Triple Issues goes back in the ring, going to try and break the referee's count. Rich Bass, no stranger to the antics of one Triple Issues, the OG of New England. I mean, I guess on the streets, that's what they call him, is Trigger. So I'm not down with all this lingo. You're not know. down with OPP? No, you know me. Okay. There it is. All right. But yeah, I, I don't understand most of the lingo. <laughs> I was, however, looking up uh, what a bacon neck is. And it's basically when like your the collar of your shirt is like wrinkled. So like it's like wrinkled up and it looks like a piece of bacon. Okay. So I think it's supposed to make it like consider it weak. Like the, the collar of the shirt's weak, so he's weak. Got it. Uh, it's uh, I, I don't, I can't keep up with these kids in these terms. I'm being educated here tonight. I, I had to educate myself. I mean, thank God for the Urban Dictionary, huh? I, yeah, I thought I was young, but uh, I don't know anything now. No, no, I'm far too old to be even hanging out with these people. Jump to the chest. wow! And did you see Watts fall, man? He was, I was gonna say, he almost folded him in half. The shred god Brandon Watts has been making a name for himself. Oh yeah, okay. No, Tripolicious. He thinks he runs the place. I think Chase Del Monte might have a little issue with that. Isn't Chase the Whoa. Chase that runs the oh, place? Oh wow! He's shooting for that. He jumped up, going for a. Uh, is the patented standing moonsault from Trips? Make no mistake about it. Brandon Watts with the spring off the bottom rope into a DDT and got reversed quick. Triple Issues, a longtime veteran of the wrestling game, the New England Matt Wars, if you will. And uh, he, it's like a fine wine. He gets better with age. That He's he been does. around, but man, he can uh, he can go and then some former Chaotic Wrestling Tag Team Champion. One half of Killanova Incorporated. Yeah, he doesn't get tired. He's, he's no matter, like you said, how old he gets. Whoa, nice schoolboy out of nowhere. Kind of two for Brandon Watts. Ducks the clothesline, goes up. Threw him back to his feet again. Caught his foot. Whoa! Lands on his feet. His feet. Oh. oh. Watts now trapped in the corner. Catches a couple of chops. And oh, oh, wow. <laughs> a nice form right to the head. Sure it was. And Triple Whoop. H. Big DDT. Well done. Brandon Watts needs to cover right now. Well done by the Shred God. Gets a count of two. The former one half of Milk Chocolate, Brandon Watts, has really. Uh, transformed his career from tag team wrestler to singles competitor. Like I said, very well known in the New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania areas. And 
He is here in Chaotic Wrestling. Oh, he popped that chain. Look at Triple H. Oh, he just tried to uppercut him with that chain. Oh! That slap. Oh, must have just knocked out Triple H. And the chain just went flying. That's that patented chain that Killanova Inc. is famous for. And how he beats his opponents. Look at Brandon Watts. Brandon Watts is going to use that chain against Triple H right now. He does it right in front of the referee. He's a fool. He's going to get disqualified. Absolutely. You can't let your emotion drive. No, Rich, uh, Rich Bass is not. let that happen. Yeah, but look, Triple H has another one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Stuffed it in his trunks. One, two, and three. Unbelievable. Here is your winner, the OG of New England, Triple Licious. And look at that, that's the fitting story right there. Triple Licious with the gold chain in his mouth. Oh, this is the patented gold chain. It's like you said, these guys, I have to give them credit for this. They always have a backup plan. I mean, they now have been scouted by the entire Chaotic Wrestling locker room. Everyone who watches Chaotic Wrestling, including, including Brendan Watts, saw that chain coming from a mile away. He now has a backup chain. It's the third unofficial member of Killing Over.